Hello and welcome back everybody, this is Muhammad Saeed with you again. In this video, we're going to learn how to make our camera follow our, our player. So let's get started with our new video. Uh, so, just like every time, we're going to open our uh, Unity file. So, you see here in our last video, let me just bring this up over here. As you see in our last video, we learned how to make our uh, player move right and left. So, we, we used if statements. So, as you see here, it works. So, in this video, we're going to learn how to uh, make our camera follow our player. So, what we're going to do is we're going to go to our main camera. And we're going to add a new component. So, we're going to press on add component. We're going to say script and we're going to press on new script. Then we're going to say we're going to call it um, follow and just follow player. Okay, so I'm going to press on create and add. As you see here now in our, um, in our assets now, you see that we have a new, uh, that we have a new script. So it says follow player. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to press it so we can open our code and okay here it is. So to make our camera follow up player there's a lot of like stuff there's a lot of types there's a lot of ways. So first of all uh, the first way is and it's obviously the easiest uh, to move our main camera uh, with our player. So it's just gonna be we're gonna parent it. It means this is gonna be like this is gonna follow this. So I'm gonna just try and run this. We're gonna see what's gonna happen. It's still on, but when we move our camera down, when we fall down, you're gonna see that crazy stuff like it's moving around and the camera is moving with it. So what we want is yes okay if it folds uh, if it folds down let me stop and start again if it folds down i want the camera to like stay and have a look at it not to um like fall with it i just want the camera to stay yeah it can fall but not turn around so yeah i guess this is so easy this way is easy but there's a lot of other ways and um so we're gonna use the second way which is also it's not that easy but it's still uh like it's still we, we can still use it so what we're gonna do we're gonna put our main camera back open follow player and we're gonna remove the uh we're gonna move these uh to codes okay we're gonna remove our void start uh, we just don't need that thing. We're going to use void update. Okay. So now I'm going to start a new class. A new public class. So public. Uh, transform. Uh, transform player. Uh, so I'm going to make it normal player. Nothing capital because this is what we're gonna call it. So you see here, guys, there's transform. I'm just gonna end it with this, and then I'm gonna come back here to Unity. I'm gonna come to my main camera. So you see here that this is called transform, the place that, like, the place that has the rotation, the position. So it's called uh, transform. So that's what we're gonna do. So I'm going to say public transform player and then I'm going to press enter. Uh, so when I come, I'm going to save this and I'm going to go to Unity. So after I go to Unity, uh, you're going to see that here in our main camera, I think, yes, there's a script. But wait, let me do, let me see. Public transform I forgot the S here, so I'm gonna save that again. Uh, 
I'm gonna see that it's gonna take some time and then when it starts uh, here you see that in our follow player script <clears throat> there's something else called player here so what we're gonna do is that we're gonna drag our player and put it inside over here <clears throat> So, yeah, the second step after doing that, what we want to do is that we want to add something here called public vector. So, yeah, it's not going to work now. We have to, uh, like, finish everything. There's some uh, more stuff we need to do. So, we're going to say public vector, vector 3, I think capital vector, public vector 3. Uh, and then I'm gonna say offset. I'm gonna do this and press enter. So we're just uh, gonna make this a bit more simpler. Okay. Uh, so if you guys don't know this, uh, this text over here, uh, like it helps you understand some stuff. If you like, if you forgot something, if you think yeah, that you're gonna forget it, you wanna keep it, you wanna still know it. So just type any text and right before uh, those two marks. Um, so yeah. Uh, and you're gonna see that it's gonna go gray. So okay, after that we're gonna go to our void update and we're gonna say um, player I think transform dot position transform dot position equal to player dot position okay so we're gonna do that we're gonna say plus offset offset okay uh, so after doing that we're gonna put these uh, this mark we're gonna save everything come back to uh, unity it's gonna take some time loading and okay when we come back here uh i'm gonna i'm not sure i think there's a problem yes um uh, what does have to be fixed let me see what's the problem here um I'm not sure what it is, but I'm going to see plus offset play the position. So yeah, I'm going to see what's the problem here. So I think it's because that I uh, wrote position wrong. I corrected it. I'm going to save this and go to my unity file. I'm going to see if it works. So uh, it's going to load. I'm gonna run. Uh, I think it worked this time. I'm not sure why that. Wait. I think it's supposed to work now because I fixed the writing. Why isn't it moving? One. Okay, I'm gonna see what's the problem. Okay, so it worked now. I moved this right over here and it's working. So I'm gonna uh, see, I'm gonna try to move it. Okay, and it's working, but as you see, it's like in first player mode. So um, you can see the box from outside. You can just see it from inside. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go here to our uh, follow player script, and then we're gonna go to our offset. We're gonna make the X zero, the Y one. I think and this minus five 
or wait, I can make this minus six. I'm not sure. I'm minus four. I'm gonna try. And this minus one, run. Um, okay. It's gonna take some time loading. And as you see, guys, here it works. And um, I'm gonna see what's gonna happen if it falls down. Is the camera gonna fall down? And yes, it's gonna fall down with it, but it's not gonna keep rotating. So you can just see the cube rotating. The camera won't rotate with it. So as you see here, the camera is not rotating. So yeah, that's the difference between parenting it over here and um, using the follow player. So yeah. So that's it for this video. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. And if you did, please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. So yeah, see you in the next one. Bye.